More and more African countries are going the nuclear route. In fact, 22 African countries have already indicated that they will be pursuing nuclear as an option. And another 10 countries have actually taken the next step. They've started by formulating the nuclear legislation required in their countries, which leads to also having a nuclear regulator, uh, having accident plans in place, having plans in place for the movement of fuel, waste products and such like. Nuclear ultimately will be cheap and uh, nuclear will help to solve the demand that is increasing at a very fast pace on the African continent. While many agree that nuclear is the way to go, there is some caution that others are exercising. The issue is uh, whether at this particular moment we have the resources and we have the capacity and the capability to, to, to contain this um, uh, 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 nuclear energy. Otherwise, you don't want to get into nuclear energy and then we don't have the capacity to look into the safety uh, factor and so on, and then you create more problems. There's no question that when it comes to nuclear power provision, there's no fence sitting. People are either for it or against it. The bottom line is that it should be explored and it should become part of a total power mix. I'm Angelo Coppola for CCTV in Johannesburg.